I sing good one time. Good morning to you. That's right. Good morning to you. It's a brand new day for music, and I'm ready to rock with you. Good morning to you. Good morning, children. My name is Mr. Luthor. I'm going to open us up in prayer today. Dear Jesus, thank you for this new day to be alive. Thank you for dying on the cross for our sins. Please forgive us for all of our sins and make us right with you. We welcome your Holy Spirit presence today. Please be here with us and meet with us. We want to know you more. Please help us to listen to your word, listen to your Holy Spirit's voice, and change us from the inside out to be more like your Son, Jesus. We also ask that you protect us and care for us as we go about today. We love you, Jesus. We worship you alone. Thank you. In Jesus' name, amen. great singing that great verse today awesome job everybody and welcome back to spiritual breakfast i've got scripture squirrel here and we're going to do our memory verse you ready scripture squirrel hey Rudy, let's get to it all right what's our verse for the week it's ezekiel 11 9 it says i will give them an undivided heart and put a new spirit in them i will remove from them their heart of stone and give them a heart of Flesh. Very good. Very good, Scripture Squirrel. I know there are some people in my life that I really want God to change their heart and give them a heart of flesh and for, instead of a heart of stone. Uh, thank you for sharing that verse with us one more time. Thank you so much. Oh, don't mention it. It's so much fun. All right. Anything else for today? One more thing. I like it. I love you. Thank you, Scripture Squirrel. Great job. We've got a very special guest today, Billy Ray Fierro, with our devotion. And it's here, here. So let's pay close attention. Good morning, children. Billy Ray Fierro here with you again with another spiritual breakfast devotion. I sure do like getting good news, don't you? The best news that I ever heard was the good news about Jesus that changed my whole life. Our verse today is from the book of Isaiah, the prophet of God. In chapter 30, verse 21, it says, Whether you turn to the right or to the left, your ears will hear a voice behind you saying, This is the way. Walk in it. Hey, y'all. Have you met my friend Solomon? He's a very wise owl, and he's very skilled at blessing others. Did you know owls have very sensitive ears? It's true. As the owl flies high into the sky above, it can hear the faintest movement of a small animal on the ground far below. How? The feathers around its face act like a radar screen and collect the tiniest sound signals from the air. Then, the feathers focus the sound into the owl's ears, and it takes action. When you hear good news, what action do you take? 
you probably pass it on. But when you hear bad news, what do you do? The prophet Isaiah had prophecies for Judah and many other nations. Many times he had the news of God's judgment for the wrongs that people did. He also knew that they ignored or complained about what they heard. But this time, Isaiah had good news. This chapter in Isaiah is a prophecy about the Savior to come. That Savior did not come in Isaiah's lifetime, but he came. His life is the good news that Christians share all over the world. Ask your mom and dad today if you can look at a newspaper. If your parents don't receive a daily newspaper, you can find newspapers in the library or even on the internet. Read through some of the articles and notice whether they tell good news or bad news. Think about how wonderful it is that God's salvation is the best good news in the whole universe. Hot taters and gravy. Now, children, Let's pray and thank the Lord for his good news that changes the direction of people's lives and is the greatest news of all. Dear Lord Jesus, thank you for sharing your good news about salvation with me. Lord, help me to share it with as many people as I can. Lord, whisper your deep truth into my right and left ears. I want to hear your voice every day. In your name, Jesus, we pray. Amen. Well, I need to go now. But until I see you children again, here is a blessing and a song. You guys have a great day, okay? May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face to shine on you and give you peace. May the Lord lift up the height of his countenance on you. May the Lord protect you and keep you safe from all harm and trouble. In Jesus' name, Amen. that in every